Alright, oh my god, but next up, if you can believe it, it's the Ron Jeremy versus three random bastards match. But you know what, I'm gonna change it slightly this time of the, this, this year. It's gonna be completely different. Let's go to Arena 4. Um... Arena 4, um... Uh... Okay, that's the music set up. Um, I guess we'll go with individuals again. Why not? Uh, run-ins, none. Yeah, we'll go with none this time. All right. So in the blue corner, we'll have Ron Jeremy. Yes, there he is, Super Hornio himself. Um, he's a face, isn't he? There's Ron Jeremy, and he'll take on some random people. This time he'll be taking on four, though. Do you think he'll manage it? I don't think he will. <laughs> okay, how do I do random select again? Start. That's right. Oops, hang on, I'm on faces rather than all. There we go, let's randomize this properly. Chad Kroger is in. Uh, next is... George Costanza. George is in. But, oh no! I fucked that up, I pressed start at that screen. <laughs> I fucked this up. I will keep who uh, is currently in here though. Hang on, uh, quit that match. Uh, first of all, get rid of Tuvok. Delete entry, there we go. Which does it see? Here's what I wanted to do. Wrestler second. No. Okay. Start. Mike Pence is in for some reason. No entry. No. Uh, final wrestler. Uh, Celine Dion. Why not? All right. Okay. It's Ron Jeremy versus these four. It's going to be. Um, I mean, it's not looking good. But hey, let's change our venue here. We can change to the PBSCW arena to the Ron Ring, of course. Um, as my gun, oh, it's just, it's, oh yeah, and we want to go to, um, uh, Arena Mexico. There we go, <laughs> this is a fight in Mexico, why not? Hollow Lives Gamers stuff? What's this thing? I heard waifu noises. Ring Fit Adventure. <laughs> I'm still sad I can't give Coroni a tail. I'm really sad about that. Okie dokie, so here we go, Ron Ring, uh, we want the Arena Mexico so we can have the waifus, uh, settings, last check on that. Elimination, Lumberjack, Tornado, run-ins, none. It's fine, it's fine. Ron Jeremy's not gonna win this at all, but he will certainly try, he likes to challenge himself every year. <laughs> Ron Jeremy now enters the ring. I don't know why the crowd isn't animated on the lower half of the screen. They're just kind of frozen in time there. The Thundercock himself, Ron Jeremy, makes his way to the ring. The Ron ring, the porno... Porno uh, Sonic ring itself. It's fun, fantastic. Celine Dion is the first to enter the ring, the first opponent to take on Ron Jeremy in his bizarre bizarre desire to uh, take on uh, four opponents at once. It used to be three, but now he's just going insane. Celine Dion, the Queen of Canada, enters the ring. We've seen her fight today, earlier on. She was not the contender for best girl, but hey, what can you do? The Dictastic Arena. Mike Pence enters the ring. Not exactly a, uh, not exactly a wrestler, but you know. Not exactly a wrestler, he's more of a manager, but you know what, the the, uh, the random selection selected him, so uh, that's what we're going to have to go with. <laughs> George is getting upset! As he enters the ring! George Costanza is ready to go with his lovely purple and gold spandex. It is the summer of George. Might want to change Mike's title. Uh, it's still valid for this year. <laughs> It's still valid for this year, so that's fine. Oh my god! <laughs> fucking dilly-eyed fuck himself, Chan Kroger's back again. Look at this photograph, he looks like he's recovered pretty well after that beating he got in the old PBSCW. Dilly-eyed fuck Chan Kroger enters the arena as the fourth opponent for Ron Jeremy. It's not looking good. What the hell is on Joey's head? Who gives a shit? Fight! And he has both his feet as well. <laughs> all right, and Ron Jeremy, all right from the get-go. He's fighting them off. Oh yeah, he's doing his best to fight. It's looking like it's gonna be an uphill battle now. He has to get rid of 
four people. It's uh, it's not looking likely, but he'll give it a try. No confidence. Give no up. confidence. Give up. I don't think Ron Jeremy's got this one, but he's gonna try. God damn it, he's gonna try and win this. He's gonna do his best. I remember when you did this with Kira when he won. <laughs> Uh, oh yeah, I vaguely remember that. Ron actually won. Oh wait, Kiru won. I can't remember which one won, but yeah, I vaguely remember that. I need to re-watch that match. Oh my goodness gracious me. Celine Dion there with a kick to the back of the head. Oh my goodness, it's it's not looking good for Ron Jeremy. Oh, Mike Pence and Celine Dion there with a the team up there. Shane Croak with the pin. Oh, he's not quite out just yet. And George Costanza with a spinning drop there, very nice. It's like a spinning powery bomb thing. Oh, and Chad Kroger goes for the groin. He knows, he knows Ron Jeremy's number one weakness, he knows. I mean, everyone should know by now. Oh my god, I love the Ron ring so much though. Look at those apron curtains. Fantastic. Also, the, uh, the turnbuckle padding has Ron written on it. Good times. Oh, and there's a there's a backbreaker there. It's not having that. Oh, Jesus Christ. Pence there ruining the shit out of Ron Jeremy's shoulder. Off the ropes, and there's a kick. No one interrupted Celine D on that time, and oh my god. Ron Jeremy not doing too well, but then again against four opponents. How is he supposed to? And he's outside the ring. Chad Kroger says, I'll deal with this. Everyone else can stay inside and just sort of stand on top of each other. Looks a bit odd, but yeah, sure. Oh, it was 2018. Oh, okay. There's an elbow to the back of the head. All these PBS champion wrestling streams are starting to blend together, man. Okay. Oh, there's another lock up there again. Oh, oh. And there's a pounding on his back. It's not looking good for, for Ron Jeremy at all. He's trying, though. He's fighting. He's still fighting. It just doesn't look too good. Oh, dear. Five minutes have already gone. Let's hope Watt and Jeremy will be in one piece to service all of those waifus dancing on the uh, it's on the runway later tonight. Yes. Mike Pence appealing to the audience for more cheers as the rest of them pummel the shit out of Ron Jeremy. But he's fighting back. Oh, as Mike Pence though drops him forward and this could be the end. This could be the end for Ron Jeremy. He's trying. The fact he's fighting so good so well right now is a is a miracle unto itself. He's just hanging in there for the time being. So many people to kick in the groin. Oh my god! Ron Jeremy actually fighting back and oh Mike Pence sends it to the ground again. What does Mike Pence have against against Ron Jeremy? Uh oh. Oh, top rope, but that didn't work out at all. Ron Jeremy now sent flying all the way down to the mat, and it could be over now. It's not looking too good for him. As he's thrown into the ropes, and oh my god, multiple kicks to the face. As George Costanza and Chad Kroger both boot him on the way in. Ron Jeremy now, trying to fight back. Running with scissors as a job where po P in P4 where dude ends up being a VTuber somehow. That would be fun. Okay, oh, Ron Jeremy's still fighting back. He is hanging in there. You gotta give it to him. You gotta hand it to Ron Jeremy. He knows how to take a beating. He is hanging in there, Chad Kroger now. He's in a tussle with him. Oh, Chad Kroger though, with a drop kick and down goes Ron Jeremy. But then he headbutts him and in retaliation. George now spinning the finger, number one for him. Oh dear, it's not looking good though for Ron Jeremy. Oh my God. Yep, no, it's not looking amazing for him, but he's, he's gonna keep on trying. He's hanging in there. No one feels like they wanna pin him just yet. It is still anyone's game. I don't know if this is elimination based. I hope it isn't. Because uh, Ron Jeremy eliminating four opponents one after the other is uh, highly unlikely. <laughs> highly, highly unlikely. And Pence is sent into the gate there. I suggest again Travis touchdown for PBSCW. Uh, there are no laser swords in this, but I could probably do something like that. Oh my god. Pence now punching Ron Jeremy as he's outside the ring. Everyone else is standing in the center to sort of, uh, I don't know. They're all just coalesced together. 
Rom's still fighting back. Oh my god, he's actually trying. Yes. Oh my god, and there's the pin there from George. Three, it's over. George pins Ron Jeremy. And that's the end of this crazy experiment. <laughs> oh, goodness me. Oh. I mean... I mean, kudos to Ron Jeremy. Ron Jeremy. Back off! <laughs> oh my god. Ron Jeremy. He lasted way longer than anyone else probably would have. That guy knows how to deal with four opponents. I mean, he ultimately lost, but it was nearly 11 minutes. And yes, that is a 77% match of ever I was able he lost to a power slam and a hook leg pinfall. Nom nom time. I'm gonna check this video here. Let's see. Handicap match. Uh, standard. Oh, it was Kiru versus like three people. And that was 2018. You are right. Oh my god. No more of that Matt Dickey bullshit. We don't want it. We don't want it in our lives. Ugh. Oh god, back to the world of yeah. standard definition. This theme is just, um... Oh, you hate to see it's it. It's one of the, uh, stop games, this shit. uh, musics, but I can't hear it very well. Standard definition PBS champion wrestling. Yeah. I'm glad we can say goodbye to those days. Holy fuck. It's, it's vaguely oriental. Alright. Yeah, well, he's yeah. ready to go. Works for me. Yeah. So, basically, how did he win, though? Uh... He went, oh, he just pinned Hurdy, Hurdy Gurdy to the to the mat. Two and three! Oh my god, he actually did it! <laughs> he actually did it. Oh, kind of crazy how that works.